Welcome to Fashion Frenzy. If you haven't already, see the previous episodes. Please welcome our guest judge, Jazz. Now, should we announce the theme? But first, Pandora's box is back, and whoever opened Pandora's box, power lasts for this episode and two episodes more. Dude, said Pandora's box. The double twist has been unleashed into the house. Please welcome our two new contestants, Emmy and Barbie. Not this. This round will be Chat, played we are in done. pairs. Oh shit. <laughs> it is important that this round will be played in pairs. Due to Puller having the most amount of votes without being eliminated the last round, she has decided on the pairs. Now, these are the pairs. Park Bench and Puller. Lemon and Barbecue. Cammy and Painted Sage. And Emmy Barbie. The theme for tonight is your favorite cartoon, movie, slash TV show. Your timer starts now. Since we'll now have 15 minutes to come up with the looks, here are the separate teams. Team 1 is Park Bench and Pooler. Team 2 is Barbecue and Lemon Tart. Team 3 is Cammy and Pain and Sage. And Team 4 is Emmy and Barbie. Pain and Sage sadly couldn't make this recording due to being called to work last minute. However, Zombie Puppy will be replacing them only for today. Perfect! Hey, have a good day. Y'all can keep that trash too. Thank you. What is your guys' inspiration for tonight? Like, what we're, what are we picking? Yeah. We're doing Descendants. <laughs> descendants? Yeah. Like, old people? Like, like the Disney movie, Descendants. Like oh! <laughs> You know, that makes a lot more sense. Okay, beautiful. Oh, so we are doing um, emotions from inside out too. So I'm disgust and lemon tart is anger. All right. Hello. Hello, you guys. What oh, is... Lord. <laughs> what oh, is hi. tonight's inspiration? I'm sorry, what? My Little Pony. My... We're um, Twilight Sparkle and Spike. Oh, all right, you guys. A person. Oh, hello. 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 Silent silence has entered the chat. What is the inspiration for tonight? Uh, we are going with um, a look from The Hobbit. And we're... Thank you, Mike. Thank you. We're going to do Gandalf and Bilbo Baggins. Ooh, all right, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. A little fantasy <laughs> moment, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, could you tell us a little bit more about your looks? Our look is from Descendants 1. <coughs> I'm Mal. She's Evie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and why did you guys pick Descendants? It's iconic. The greatest music. I think they look stunning, you know? Not gonna lie. I, I, I obviously didn't know what Descendants was. Descendants. Yeah. <laughs> like old people but i i looked it up and i have it pulled up in google right now and honestly i think it's pretty spot on i might have to agree with shadow maybe a wig or a weave oh my gosh she's bald she's bald and she's torturing people who have hair i think from zero to ten um definitely a nine out of ten yeah so i'd agree i'd say a nine I'm gonna say an 8, y'all. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, we'll just go with 8.5. Lemon, do you want to talk or do you want me to? I, I guess I will. Uh. We are from Inside Out, both movies, and we decided to do the emotions. And then, really quick, I love how Barbecue put the name tag in green. But I was just kind of hoping that Lemon would also put the name tag as like red to match the emotion, but that's just small little details. The only critique I would have is maybe on BBQs having the lashes on the penguin, because like Disgust has like these very like large, luxurious lashes. But other than that, you guys absolutely nailed it, and I think it's it's perfect. I immediately recognized what you guys are going for. My titties perfectly plastic. Yeah. I like my money to rest it. This pussy pop back elastic. You bitches don't want no static. Took y'all long enough. Uh, we're uh, Twilight Sparkle and Spike from My Little Pony. 
anything else to add? No. Uh, Cammy, I'm pretty sure the horn is purple. Well, do you have the money for a purple horn and the time to wait for the horse party? I don't think so. <laughs> Clock that tea. Clock it. Clock that tea. Clock it. Clock it. Um, so our outfits are inspired by the characters Bilbo and Gandalf. Um, yeah, I just, it's just, it's very, it's literally just because it's giving Shire, like, <laughs> the place where he, like, lives, like, Hobbiton, because, like, mothering. I really love the attention to detail, how you went through almost every single piece of each outfit and uh, really explained it in detail. It truly gave me hope. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Yep. Yep. As you guys know, it is the double twist, which is the reason Emmy and Barbie are here. And there's another factor to this double twist. Two people will be going home tonight. <laughs> right now, two duos will be put up for elimination and each duo will compete against each other the winning duo of this round will also compete against each other not to see who goes home but to see who wins the round one of the duos will be decided by us and the other duo will be decided by you guys the winners of this round with a perfect score of 10 out of 10 are barbie and emmy you guys will be competing to see who wins this round I'm voting against barbecue and lemon. I'm the same. I absolutely loved it. I just, I love my little pony. Absolutely uh, heartbroken right now. Betrayal. Voting for uh, Pooler and Park Bench. Just because I think My Little Pony is a little bit more recognizable and I had a hard time recognizing who they were until like the last moment. So doing Pooler and Park Bench. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm voting against Team One because I still don't even know who they're supposed to be. They're not just, they're just not very recognizable. I think it's like it's fashion frenzy, not like who's the most popular character frenzy. Cammy and Zombie. Um, just because I feel like My Little Pony is super recognizable and I feel like their outfits didn't do that justice. Well. Um, I actually would also vote against Cammy and Zombie. Um, I don't think they're giving what they need to give. Ooh. Ooh. Team one has been put up for elimination. The team with the lowest score, who will also be competing against each other, is team three. Theme for Park and Pooler is Space Explorer, Cammy and Zombie's theme will be superhero and villains, and Barbie and Emmy's theme will be Arctic Expeditions. We're gonna start with Barbie and Emmy. We thought that they were both really strong looks. Um, however, we liked one a little better. Um, I really liked, we all really liked Barbie's look and how aesthetically pleasing it was. However, we really liked how Emmy's backstory was and how the bear, the spike, the furry cuffs, the crossbow. So Emmy um, has won this round. Park and Fuller, you guys could please come up. Well, uh, it really hurts to send one of you guys home. Um, you guys are both really strong competitors. However, Pooler, you have been eliminated. Look no! <laughs> it's okay. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? Maybe I'll get to come back at some point. Yeah, I'm gonna miss you. <laughs> <laughs> Alpha! It's Alpha! Tonight was such a roller coaster. I thought I was going home. I think this one has been the hardest decision of all day, of like literally all the rounds. I think they're both insanely good looks. Cami, I really like how you use the seal. And we all really instantly knew who you were. And Alpha, originally when we first saw it, we thought, okay, it's good, but I'm not necessarily sure who it is. However, your backstory and everything you told us was amazing. And this was a really hard one. But with a heavy heart, Cami, you have been eliminated. Um, what was it? Was it Angel? Was that their name? Yeah. I thought they would be out. Can I use my immunity? Immunity? Okay. <laughs> 
So if you guys don't know, Cammy was the one who opened Pandora's box, and Cammy was able to save someone from the last episode until two more uh, from elimination. So she will be saved from elimination, and only Pooler will be eliminated tonight. Wow. That is rat behavior. The rat behavior, you should be very ashamed of yourself to act like a rat 